Just as the sunrise starts to show Warming up the motorway You know you felt this way before But can't recall the time and day Don't know if life is a small part Of something greater And when you get off this raging Control over my actions. I am led by the Spirit. I am led by the Spirit. I am led by the Spirit. Good job. I am a victor, not a victim. I am complete in Christ alone. Good job, Jude. I just asked him if he said it wrong, so I just said it better. So you said it better? Yeah. I am a truth teller. I'm a truth teller. I have purpose. I have purpose. I have salvation through Jesus. I have salvation through Jesus. I am strong in the Lord. I am strong in the Lord. I am patient. I am patient. I am generous. I'm generous. I am being changed into his image. I'm being changed into his image. I live by faith in Christ alone. I live by faith in Christ alone. Good job. Why did God make you and all things? Good job. How can you glorify God? By loving Him and doing what He commands. Why should you glorify God? 
Good job. Are there more gods than one? No, What? What, mister? There's only one God, and in how many persons does this one God exist? Three. Three persons. Who are they? God, Father, no, the fa no, the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Good job. The Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Who is God? Ezra, you know this one real well. Who is God? He's not. He is, he is the he, he is the spirit. He is a spirit and he does not have body like men. Good job. Where is God? He's everywhere. God is everywhere. Can you see God? No, I cannot see God, but he can always see me. Praise God from whom all blessings flow. Stop. Praise him all creatures here below. Praise Him above ye heavenly hosts. Praise Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. Amen. Good job, guys. That sounded great. Children, abide in Him so that when He appears, we may have confidence and not shrink from him in shame at his coming. If you know that he is righteous, Gigi, sit back down, please. No, you can sit on this side of me if you'd like. The, is that it did not know him. Beloved, we are God's children now, and what we will be has not yet appeared. But we know that when he appears, we shall be like him, because we shall see him as he is. And everyone who thus hopes in him purifies himself as he is pure. morning you guys it's been kind of a crazy morning already <laughs> this little guy has um, I think getting he's getting some teeth in right now um, everything in me honestly said I'm not even gonna film today there's no chance I'm gonna get anything that's gonna be interesting to watch but um, I decided that I'm gonna do it anyways just because this is a reality of trying to homeschool with a little one and then four other little ones. <laughs> so good morning and welcome. Um, we just finished up morning basket. We didn't get to too much of it because this little guy was not having it. He has acid reflux, um, which we do treat, but he also is starting to teethe, I think now. So it's just real fun. <laughs> we have like the three month sleep regression happening and he's getting teeth in and he has acid reflux so you'll see he, i gotta change him because he spit up but he's also like drooling <laughs> just all the things and then like to not trying to um hold a camera while i'm doing schoolwork or while i'm doing morning basket and you know juggling it all is just kind of impossible a little impossible so so yeah so we just finished morning basket up oh honey and um i'm gonna take him upstairs and get him changed the kids are all going upstairs and doing uh chores and things like that it's a it feels like a monday it's the day after martin luther king jr day um so it, 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 it technically is a Monday basically for us because my husband's back to work today. He had yesterday off. So we've got like dishes in the sink and a messy house and all the things, but I'm still trying to get some school done. Hey, hey. Even if it's just English and math, then that will be good because I don't know what we're gonna get done today. I don't know. I don't know, huh? I'm not sure what we're gonna get done. I'm not sure we got, oh look at that one tear. That one lonesome tear. <laughs> 
Um, today's video is a collab with my friend Jamie. My my friend Jamie, yes, you heard me right. Um, my name is Jamie, but my friend Jamie over at Simply Live In It. Jamie is a homeschooling mom of all boys and her kids are a little older than mine so she's in a different season of life than me 100 percent. so her video will be a lot different than mine is but i think that i don't know what my kids i think that they're playing with tinker toys upstairs i hear it dragging on the floor or the wall or something anyways her video is going to be very different than mine <laughs> mine is going to be a little bit more chaos because mine are my kids are all really young still um, but she's going to be sharing a day in the life um, of just a winter day homeschooling and I am doing the same. So definitely make sure to head over to Jamie's channel after you're done watching this and watch her video. And if you're new to my channel from Jamie's, welcome. Welcome to my little teeny spot here on YouTube um, where I share everything from homeschooling to motherhood, um, lifestyle, all the things in between. Hi. This is Fiona. <laughs> Baby, baby Abe. I always call him Baby Jude. I'm so because he he looks so much like Jude did at this age. But this is our little guy Abe. I never thought that I would be traveling this road. People keeps missing. The clouds seem to fade. Absolutely my life right now <laughs> uh, Finding random things that they threw inside of the dryer. I think this one was thrown in the dryer after this uh, Was completed because I would have heard it, but yeah, so a car I'm happy to hear that you'll still be around I thought you were leaving without a sound In my little world you are both pros and cons It's hard to admit when you feel you don't belong So tell me are you still in there As beautiful as you are You just don't know by Right by your side with arms Even if you don't want You wrote your name in my heart ideal world I would have woken up before the kids and turn the his swing down um, and <laughs> did some devotional time made my bed did all the things but in this world <laughs> the real world uh, that didn't happen um, Abe is not sleeping through the night and I am just so exhausted in the morning time like I am I'm so spent every morning it feels like so I kind of just wake up with the kids and then we go downstairs we do morning basket together while I'm drinking coffee and then kind of 
take care of all of the stuff that we need to take care of, breakfast, and then ease our way into school. He is in his swing right now, so he's probably gonna be going to bed soon, which might free up some time for us to get some lessons done, which would be nice, um, but it might not happen though too. <laughs> I might have to be sitting down with them, doing some schoolwork while I'm rocking him or holding him, and if he is fussing enough, then school might have to get put off until later. It just depends. I've got piles of laundry that the kids are gonna have to um, pull out of here and and sort through. I've got stuff in that corner that I gotta go through. I just feel a little disheveled right now, postpartum life. Um, it's It can be frustrating because I know what I want to do and I know what my plans are and all of the things that I want to accomplish. And then having a little baby and a three-year-old um, my five, seven, and eight-year-olds are pretty responsible for the most part, I mean, for that age. And they get their stuff done that they're supposed to. Um, they are super, super helpful, like, so helpful. Such a blessing to me. Um, but there's still, you know, there's the responsibility of motherhood that comes when you've got little ones uh, and lack of sleep, and it's just, it's just difficult sometimes. So I will say that that one thing I love about Jamie is that, um, not me and I'm not speaking in third person again, <laughs> Jamie from Simply Living It. One thing I love about her is that whenever she shares morning routines or like a day in the life video and she shows what her mornings look like, she always says like, this is what it looks like for this season of my life. And I really, I love that because for me in this season of life, I don't wake up early in the morning and work out. I don't get a lot of like quiet time devotional right now. It just, it doesn't happen for me. And so it's kind of, we're kind of living in a state of, I don't want to say chaos because that sounds so negative, but we're living in a state of like, this is just, it is what it is, you know? And so trying to get through it, but also trying to enjoy it because this is our last baby. So <laughs> the messes, the laundry, you know, the baby that is in the swing because it's one of the only places that he'll sleep. It is what it is. So Ezra is downstairs practicing guitar. He finished his morning stuff. I think Abe is wanting to nurse again. So we'll just ride it out and see what's next. Hopefully we get some schoolwork done this morning. Fiona, can you grab um, your pile of laundry and bring it into your bedroom? And then Jude is gonna need to bring his in too. And then I'll take care of Abe's. But yep, I think he's wanting to nurse.
<laughs> I hear you, Bubby. I hear you. Hold on. So I just paid the first bill <laughs> from his birth right now. Right? So we're about halfway done with his birth. Hopefully, I hope that that's, that's all, that it's, that it's half and then we have the other half to pay. But sometimes you get, you get like random other bills and stuff. We already got ours from the midwife. Oh, buddy. Oh, Bubba. What? What? What's wrong, huh? What's wrong, honey boy? Honey boy? Huh? What's wrong? I put on some makeup on my face, so I feel like a little bit less like a zombie. It's amazing when you get yourself ready, you just feel so much better. Sometimes it doesn't happen as early as I'd like it to, but... It's still good. It still feels good. He's got his little bandana on. <laughs> Kids will probably have lunch soon and then we'll start on school. I think we're probably going to end up having you do school just this afternoon today because this morning has just been really long. But I don't have to worry too much about dinner tonight because I have um, frozen spaghetti sauce that I made that I froze. So I'm just pulling that out and then I've got garlic bread and noodles and salad, so that'll be a good meal. Everybody will eat it and like it, <laughs> fingers crossed. Good job. There's a lion. Did you put the sheep in already? No. Where's the sheep at? Let's find this sheep. So she is playing this little game that we just got it from Amazon. Um, this kids category sorting toy, and this was one of the toys that she got for Christmas um, by a company called Aug Toy, A U G T O Y. But she likes doing this, and this is something that I can just sit down with her and do. She's only three, um, but she likes to be able to sort. So, okay, so let's go ahead and pick out your shapes. So let's go ahead, we'll do through this one for me, please. Don't, around, draw, drew, drink, during, the, earth. Good job. All right, Family, this one. Family, find, funny, girl, called, going, gold. Good job. Eight. Good job. Um, I mean. Yeah, right there. Aren't they cool? Good morning. He went outside on top of a small hill. What does that leaf say? Beach. Beach. Where do you want to put that one at? Make it a nice bed for him. Alright, so Ezra is finishing up cutting up his little paper for his language arts lesson, I'm going to fill up my water because I'm trying to drink more water.
for those of you guys that have asked me, um, we do have a Berkey. It has been something that we've been wanting to get for a long time and finally we invested in it and I am so thankful <laughs> and um, never going back, ever. So if you guys um, have never heard of the Berkey water filtration system, it is amazing. It is definitely an investment, but it is just so good for you and the filtration system, like you can't, you can't beat it. You cannot beat it at all. We have the biggest one that they make just because um, we felt like for our family size that it was just the best fit for us and we love it. Um, and so I just kind of keep it in that little nook over there. I got that little table from Lowe's last year, right when we bought the Berkey, I got that table for it. Um, and it's been nice because, or this cabinet, it's been nice because it's got extra drawers. If you look in our kitchen, we have a total of four drawers in this kitchen. One, two, three, and four. That's it. That's the only drawers that we have in our kitchen. And so this is nice because I have just some extra little spaces to put things. So I just put like my spices and stuff over in that little cabinet. All right, guys, we have finished up school for this afternoon. I didn't get too much footage of all of that because I felt like it was just enough just to be able to get it done. We had kind of a crazy day with this little man. So thank you so much for joining us in today's video. I know it wasn't super exciting, but this is basically what our days look like every day right now with having a little guy in school. Um, I hope that you will go check out Jamie's channel and watch her day in the life. She is so inspirational, so I can't wait to see what her day looks like. It's probably a lot different than mine. If you are new and coming from Jamie's channel, I would love it if you would subscribe and stick around for more lifestyle, motherhood, and homeschool videos. I hope you guys have a good day and I'll see you guys in the next one.